Hey guys, again, welcome back to my channel. So what I wanted to do is do something very different and kind of nerve-wracking, um, but I want to show you guys how I do my eyebrows. Um, fair warning, uh, I have very slim, thin, very sparse eyebrows. Um, so if you want to know how I did this, Keep watching. Right, so I want to get you guys up close and personal as far as what my eyebrows look like right now. Um, so if you notice that they're very thin and they're just sparse, they're not necessary. Like they're all over the place. I do have. It's not enough. <laughs> so what I normally do is that I use. I've used a lot of pomades, I've used a lot of uh, pencils before, and I've only found one that really works for me right now, and it is actually the Ilana and Project Vanity's um, uh, Life Proof Eyebrow Gel and Dark Brown. So I know that I did a review on this before, but I'm actually showing you guys what I do on a daily basis, you know, and, and how I do my eyebrows. I actually have a uh, combo skin uh, so that I have oily and dry patches as well and it it is difficult to keep any product on my face and it with this particular one guys if you put a lot of product on it will stay uh, quite a bit of time or it'll stay a long time um, but I try not to use too much because I think it for me it just looks too um, I guess bulky and, and just very unnatural um, so I try as much as possible to not use too much product um, but yeah so yeah let's get this started so I take this and I use this brush and I actually got this on one of those sets that those like kind of bamboo or those wooden handle brushes and I've seen a couple of them I got this back in the States but I got um, I've seen a lot of um, of these on Lazada and they're not super expensive so if you guys want to give it a try um, it comes with like I think five or six brushes this actually works for me because of the fact that it is dense at the bottom and I feel like I have more control because most of the brushes that I've seen it's very thin and also as well it's long so I feel like I don't get the right control this one helps me a lot um, so yeah, sometimes guys, especially if you're starting out, the brush can help you and guide you through. Um, and I've tried different brushes. This is actually the one that I've used and I've had this for, gosh, years. I'll show you guys how I do my eyebrows and I'll show you guys, you know, how to do it uh, by using this stuff and just guiding you guys through. Now, normally, when you do your eyebrows this is the rule of thumb this is where your eyebrows should start that line right there <laughs> then when you do your arch it should be right about there so that little that angle right there that's exactly where it should start or the, the highest point and then you do the same thing but this is actually now your tail okay and yeah, so let's get started. Um, I've used this a lot and I've used this every day almost. And I'm just taking a bit and just brushing some to the side to make it a little bit pointier at the end. So I feel like I have more control. And I'm putting most of the product actually on the tip of the brush. I'm gonna try to do this um, here. So I'll put my mirror here. Um, so starting, I normally start here. Again, just like with eyeshadow, it works the same way. Um, you know, a little bit of product and you build it up. Okay, so my face looks so different. <laughs> so look, all right. And we're gonna do the other side and I'm gonna still build up product on uh, my brows. Um, it's up to you if you want to add 
um, eyeshadow or brow powder. Um, brow powder and eyeshadow to me, it, it kind of works the same. Oh, it actually works the same. All right. Now, if you notice that this one is a little bit darker, which is fine, you can actually still add more product. That means I just didn't put enough product on this side. Just as long as they're similar, guys, they're not gonna be twins. Um, no one's face is symmetrical and perfect from one side to the other. Um, so, of course, it's not gonna be the same. Just as long as they're sim somewhat, you know, sisters it's fine <laughs> somewhat sisters they're fine all right um so i'm just gonna add more product here so that's pretty much it now if you want to take it a step further again like i said i don't want to put too much of this pomade on uh because it becomes and just like every other pomade that I've actually used, um, if you put too much, it becomes very kind of thick. The product is very thick. Uh, what I take is just eyeshadow. All right, and then I'll probably just focus on Buff and Anduron. Um, so yeah, get up in there. I mix the two because again, my brows are not just brown. Um, it's dark brown. And all right so that's how I normally do my brows. Okay, so um, I've used the eyeshadow palette and I've also used the um, pomade. Um, what I do is I actually just normally clean it up, um, especially when I wanna put eyeshadow on. Um, I'll show you guys how I do that. So I'm just taking Maybelline's uh, Fit Me Concealer in 10 Light and I don't use too much. I'll just put some at the back of my hand so this, you know. <laughs> and get a brush now I normally just use something like this just taking this brush and I'm going to clean up the bottom I'm just taking my finger and then just blending it out Thanks so much guys for watching. I hope you found this particular video entertaining. Um, if you did like it, make sure to hit that like button also as well. Um, make sure to hit that subscribe button and also as well leave a comment on what you would like me to do next. And also as well make sure to follow me on Instagram at Um Thanks so much for watching guys. Bye!